Welcome back to boat week three on the RC Sailors, and this time we're in 4K. <laughs> and we're back with one of my favorite boats of all time. This is so cool. It sold out so quickly years ago when we did a video on this and someone has finally remade it. What makes it look so cool is the dual pontoons. Very cool, it's like a race boat, but it looks like it has an actual outboard motor on the back. Now this is not the actual motor, it just looks like one. This is the steering servo and the rudder and it's just disguised to look like a motor. Check this out though. We're actually running a 3S brushless setup on this very hobby grade RC boat. This is super cool. It is water cooled. Believe it or not, a boat with this shape you wouldn't think would be self riding, but check this out, Abby. There's a giant hole in the back of my boat. It is self riding. What's going to happen is if this boat flips over, water is going to slowly pull into this, even in this opening here and up front on this side only. It's going to make this side so much heavier that it's just going to roll over. It'll actually be upside down. It'll start to roll over and then auto flip about to this level. It's gonna sit crooked in the water and I'll show you guys, we'll do a flip test. Then when you start driving fast, the water will gush out the back of that where that hole is and then it's gonna be able to run smoothly. It's a really great setup, a good design for a boat like this. It'll go fast and if it flips, you don't really have to worry about how to get your boat back. So in today's video, we're gonna put this thing to the test and see if it's still one of the best RC boats for under $200 Oh, I'm just bringing back such good memories, Abby. I love this boat. Kind of a unique hatch system. This one locks here and here, but then you also have a lock on the front bottom of the boat. And there we go. Now this boat, because it's true hobby grade, doesn't have to touch water before the prop will activate. So be careful, don't bump the throttle while you're plugging your battery in. We're gonna start upside down. And if my theory's right, that should just fill right up and flip right over, that was so fast. Now I am so pumped for this boat being 3S and brushless. From what I remember, it was, back in the day, one of our fastest boats we owned, Abby. Here we go. Hold on, I'm getting a phone call. <laughs> okay, sorry, that doesn't happen very often. Here we go. Let's ease into the throttle, make sure that water gets out of there. And it looks like it's gonna need trimmed up a hair, so I don't wanna go full throttle on this without having it trimmed up. All that means is the boat is veering off to the right, so I'm gonna twist this little knob on my radio right here and hope that it'll drive straight after I twist that knob. And... It's... Oh, okay, it's a clicker. That's weird. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right, you were twisting enough. a knob that did nothing. Yeah, here we go. Full throttle. Here we go. There's full throttle on this 3S brushless RC boat. It looks like it has an outrunner motor on the back, but it does not. That is so awesome. <laughs> and it's running really solid and smooth, Abby. Very. And I just clicked. Okay, I think we have different rates there. That's what I was testing. There's one button, a third channel. Just wanted to see. I think it's already in the highest rate. So this is what we should expect on the boat. I think it looks good. It's running smooth. Not quite as fast as I remembered, but it's still a lot faster than the boat we just drove in the first video of Boat Week. I think we've had a lot faster boats. <laughs> we have, but Abby, <laughs> back in the day when we did this. Now this is still fast. I'm not trying to make it sound you know, bad or anything. It's just not as fast as some of these crazy ones we have. And I was just expecting it to be a little rocket on the water. This is still fast. I'm gonna get quiet here for a couple of drive-bys. You got quiet. Yep, That's me. <laughs> All the pollen is so bad. <laughs> Just that time of the year. This is such a good boat, Abby. I know I'm not setting any records on the channel here with this, but it's rock solid. Look how stable it is. Have you ever seen a boat ride that stable on the water? It's very cool. And it just looks awesome with the dual pon pontoons. It looks like it has a real boat motor on the back, like an engine 
on the back of the boat. You never know. If a person wasn't into RC boats, they would think that motor on the back of the boat, or engine rather, it's the fake engine, would be what was powering it. And that is very cool. I think it's my turn. It is your turn, Abby. I'm gonna pass the controls to you. We need some Abby famous bow nuts. All right, boss. <laughs> Let's see what you got. Now this comes in orange and red. And Abby is starting strong with those bow nuts in 4K. Abby, that's the world's first RC Sailors brushless bow nuts. In 4K. I think my favorite thing about this boat is the battery connection. It's Deans. universal, like Dean's very yep. common. And so you can, and it looked like there was plenty of space. There was. You could put bigger batteries in there. Yeah. Now, the, the depth of the battery needs to be fairly thin. Like, it can't be a massive battery, but the length of the battery can be much bigger. Uh, if you had a thin battery, you could put foam padding in there to help hold it in tight. No Velcro required. So we'll see how that holds up, because we're basically driving it about as hard as a person would drive this boat. Big it's truck. Stable. It's super stable. I thought I almost flipped it, and now I'm literally trying to flip it unsuccessfully. Yeah, look at you. It's a good boat. It is a good boat. I just, again, I love the way this thing looks, and it is, it is boogieing. I think one thing that makes it seem like it's not insanely fast is it sounds different than other boats. It's almost quieter. It's not Definitely screaming. Quieter. And that's interesting. Also, it doesn't have a giant rooster tail shooting up the back. That's a pretty good speed though. If you wanted a kid or someone that was really never in the boat hobby to try something that is fast in RC boats, this would be a really good one to try. And Abby, I don't think this boat has telemetry. So when the battery gets low, it's probably just going to die out there. Now, I could be wrong but this radio doesn't have any beeps, so yeah. Okay, we had a little intermission there. As I said, boats kind of make you popular when you're at the lake, basically always. Especially when like millions of people have seen our boat TikToks. Yeah, it's kind of insane. So now it seems like whenever we go out, especially if it's middle of the day and not evening time like this, people honk while we're trying to film and stuff and then they'll come and talk and it's hard to get the video. Well, that's done. okay. It's cool though. It's cool. We've always been recognized on YouTube, but for whatever reason, since we started posting TikToks, we can't even go to the grocery store now. <laughs> Abby, this is an insanely long run, run time on the included battery. What do you say we bring it in and do a water test? Okay. I'll let you kind of taxi it right in here. Very nice, very nice. Oh, oh, okay. oh nice, good reverse. <laughs> we're gonna let all that water fall out the back. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, what we do is the very much appreciated RC Sailor water test on these boats to see if they hold any water after a good solid run. Now, a lot of boats say they require boat tape, but we always like to run without boat tape just to see how it does. Yeah. And most of the time they stay pretty dry. There's a little bit of water in there, probably about a teaspoon worth in this corner. Let's just show you on the concrete here, right next to that super healthy magic stick there. There you go. That's what we had inside. <laughs> I was like, what is he talking about? I didn't know what else to call it. <laughs> guys, that is a 1200 milliamp LiPo battery. It comes with its own charger although if i remember right, i'm pretty sure this one had a european plug so you might want to pick up a converter when you get this just take a look uh in the specifications when you press order sometimes that happens now you can pick one up on on ebay or amazon for about like a dollar or 50 cents but you can go to walmart and buy those for like 15 bucks too their markup is just so fair you know this is a really good setup i love the brushless motor it's got its own steering servo for that rudder but the key thing about this boat is absolutely the way it looks. You better believe I'm going to be holding on to this one. I held on to our last one for a while and then a good friend, you guys probably remember the little guy that was a great pilot, his name was Lane. He flew planes at our airfield. He wanted to get an RC boat and I wanted to make sure he had a good one. So I sold him one of my favorites for cheap. And I kind of regretted that because I love that boat and I stopped selling it. I 
I was without that boat and finally it's a different brand someone else has made it and I think they've done an exceptional job this is a great boat if you love the way it looks I highly encourage you to pick one up because who knows it may get discontinued uh, or sold out and I don't know if they'll keep making it maybe if it sells well they'll make another round but I'm so glad to have this boat back in my collection and if you love it too we'll have a link in the description box below all I suggest all I ask is if you enjoyed this video and you plan on buying this boat please consider clicking that link and ordering it through our link it helps to support our channel and our family at no extra cost to you while we're out here today guys and we've got this glass beautiful lake to play on i just want to thank the one that's responsible for it a massive thanks to god also a huge thanks to our patreon supporters because we couldn't do what we do as often as we do it without your support it really means the world to us guys and if you're into rc boats we'll have another amazing rc boat video popping up right about now thanks for watching we'll see you there Bye.